right? First Thessalonians chapter two, starting at one, it reads for yourselves, brethren, know our interest in unto you that it was not in vain. But even after that, we had suffered before and were shamefully entreated. As you know, at Philippi, we were bold in our power to speak unto you the gospel of the Most High with much contention. I call Halal, Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Kahakodash, the Monos to the Apostles and the others of Great Millstone, peace, blessing, salutation to the hopefully lake on the four corners, putting in this work in faith, in truth, and in sincerity, risking their lives to do so on a daily basis, lives and your freedom to do so on a daily basis and to the few sisters that are trying to receive the word of Yah by Shem Yahweh Shai and this meeting is in silence I say Shalom alright this is just um, this is like a little part two my dear like a, uh, a quick a short uh, though um, speaking on contending for the faith you know the, the contentions you know that we would have you know as we go uh, you know as we um, as the it's the kingdom of the most high power is, is is you know established here on earth the contentions and the strivings and the, and the, um, you know um, you know the, the fight man okay the arguing and debating you know what I'm saying the struggle man we contend for the faith man we have to stand on on this on this word man on this truth man okay we got to stand on it man and have full faith man and 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 defend the gospel man defend the name of Yahweh Basha Yahweh Shah man okay defend the truth man okay um I was gonna do like a little part two to it through the spirit it's gonna be short like I said it's been done better by better I'm just going through it through the spirit um, you know, as we contend, man, like we just read in First Thessalonians 2 and 2, that we were bold in our power to speak unto you the gospel of the Most High with much contention, man. Okay. So, we, they, they, so what, 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 what they are saying is that they were um, entreated, shamefully entreated, man. Okay. They were treated like shit, man. All right, but yet with boldness, they still taught the word, man. Okay, with much contention, man. Okay, which means to to fight, to argue. Okay, to to struggle, to to the debate, man. Okay, we stand we stand on this word, man. Okay. <clears throat> um, go to Titus. Three and eight it reads Titus three and eight. This is a faithful saying, and these things I will that thou affirm constantly that they which have believed and the most high might be careful to maintain good works. These things are good and profitable unto men, man. Okay. So let's look at this word affirm, man. It says, I will that thou affirm constantly. Right? Let's look at that word. Man. Strong G1226. Dia be by Alma. Dia be by Alma. Right, that means to strong to affirm strongly, to assert um, confidently, man. All right, to confirm thoroughly by words. All right, to asseverate, man. Okay, to confirm, to confirm, affirm consistently, man. All right. Go back. <clears throat> so we are to affirm consistently <laughs> this word, man. Okay, this truth, man. All right. We can contend 
for the, for the faith, man. That's much contention until we enter the kingdom, man. All right? There's going to be much contention until we enter the kingdom, man. All right? Silakia. Let's go to Titus. Still stay at the Titus is one and nine. It reads Holding fast the faithful word as he hath been taught, that he may be able by sound doctrine both to exhort and convince. The game says, man, all right? So as men of the Lord, we're supposed to hold fast to sound doctrine, man, okay? Hold fast to the faithful word and be able to convince the game says, man, all right? Let's go into that. Looking to the game. A lot. Strong's G four eighty three, Auntie Lego, Auntie Lego. All right, so which means to speak against, okay? To contradict, to speak against, to dispute. To refuse, okay? So the disputers, man, those that come against the word, man, that's who we have to contend with the faith with the faith with, man. With the gang sayers, man. Alright? The disputers. Okay. Is I've heard for the um one of the brothers in Chicago, he, he said one time he said, We dispute against the disputers, man. Okay? And that's exactly what we do, man. We dispute against the disputers, man. Okay? They're running, they're running their mouth, speaking, you know, ill against the, the most high power. All right? And the, and the word, man. Let's keep reading. It says, verse 10, Titus 1 and 10. For there are many unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, especially they of the circumcision, man. Okay? That's Jake, man. Okay? Verse 11. Whose mouths must be stopped, who subvert whole houses, teaching things which they ought not for filthy lucre's sake, man. All right. So how do you how do you how do you stop the mouth of a, of a gang sale, man? Okay. By debating the, the cause, man. Okay. By debating the cause, by holding fast the faithful word, man. Okay. And when they come out. With, with 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 madness and 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 and, and, and fuckery, you 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 cut them with the, with the scriptures, man. You hit them with this truth, man. Okay. And that's all done through the spirit, man. Stone with our apostles and elders on down, man. That's why right, through the spirit, you have to be taught by men that have been taught. Okay. Passes according to the heart of the Most High, man. That is, that is showed us how to go into the Greek, how to go into the Hebrew, and how to go into the etymology. Of, of words, man, and, and have the understanding, man, okay, to prepare us, man, okay, to prepare us for the fight, man, all right, so we'll come out like Tyson on you, man, all right, old and new, okay, e either one, pick one, all right, this is, um, uh, I'm gonna go to this. I think I'll wrap it up on this. I just say this is gonna be short. About the um the contention, man. All right. Let's go into uh Nehemiah real quick. Salakia.
Go to Nehemiah 13 and 17. All right, so this is um, this is when Nehemiah. <clears throat> Jake was uh, profaning the Sabbath, man. And Nehemiah came and, con and, and, and contended for the faith, man. Okay? He contended for the faith, man. All right? All right, so let's just, let's just read it, man. The scriptures bear witness to it. In Nehemiah 13 and 17, it reads, Thus I contended with the nobles of Judah. This is Nehemiah, the prophet Nehemiah, and said unto them, What evil thing? It's just that you do, that ye do, and profane the Sabbath day, man. Okay? So they were in the profaning uh, the Sabbath, man. All right? I'm going to jump down to 21. Verse 21, Nehemiah 13 and 21, it reads, And I testified against them, okay, and said unto them, why lodge ye about the wall? If ye do so again, I will lay hands on you, man. Do that need breaking down? Do that? Do, do that? All right. From that time forth, they came no more on the Sabbath, man. Okay. So the word here that we're gonna look at is testify. You see, I testified. Strong's H, fifty-seven forty-nine, Ood, Ood. Right, which means to, uh, to duplicate, to re to repeat. All right, to protest, to testify, to affirm, solemnly warn. Okay. All right, he 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 contended for the faith, man. Okay, he testified against them, man. All right, I mean he 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 protested and argued and basically threatened them. He said he was gonna lay hands on on, on them, man. Okay, to you know to obey the laws of of the Most High Power, man. Okay, so that's what that meant when he said he testified uh, against them, man. Okay, he repeated he 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 got in their ass, man. He dug in the ass, man. He repeat, he repeat, he repeatedly, repetitively defended them and 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 and, and, and rebuked them, man. And told them they was going the fuck off, man. Okay. And he said, if you do it again, I'm gonna lay hands up on you, man. All right. Cause Jake was uh, man, Jake was doing all kind of um. All kind of abominable things, man. They was marrying foreigners, you know, which was against the law, man. And Nehemiah was um, he, he was he was he was vexed, man. Okay, as we as we are, okay, as the Most High is, so so are we, man. Okay, I wish I just drop down and. Yeah. Right, so Nehemiah 13 and 22 says, And I commanded the Levites that they should cleanse themselves and that they should come and keep the gates and to sanctify the Sabbath day. Remember me of my power concerning this also and spare me according to the greatness of thy mercy. Okay, and it reads, In those days I also saw Jews that had married the wives of Ashdod, of Ammon and Moab, man. Okay, so, we, you know, Jacob was in there breaking the law, man. It was man foreign women as wives man okay those are supposed to be concubines man moabite moabite women man okay the wives of ashdod which were canaanites right and and uh Am Am ammon ammonites the japanese and the uh the moabites which is uh, the, uh, the chinese those are supposed to be concubines man not wives man jake's going the, the, the fuck off man okay And it reads, 24, and their children spoke half in the speech of Ashdod and could not speak in the Jews' language, but according to the language of each people, man. Okay? Does it, uh, Jeremiah 10 and 2 reads, let's go to Jeremiah 10 and 2 real quick. 
Jeremiah chapter 2 reads, Thus saith Yahweh, Learn not the way of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them, man. All right, so we're commanded not to learn the way of the heathen, man. All right. And, and to this very day, <laughs> we, we are learning the ways uh, of the heathen, man. Okay. So the children spoke half of the, of, of, of the language of, of the heathen, man. They could not speak in Hebrew. Okay, with the language of the of the, uh, of the people, man, and we're commanded not to learn the way of the heathen. Man. We're not supposed to be learning no damn heathen, no, no no bastard tongue, man. Okay, we're supposed to be speak our own language, man. Okay, the Lashon Kodash and follow our law, statutes, and commandments and customs, man. Not not no damn heathens, man. Okay, but let's read. Let's continue reading. Salakia, and the Nehemiah. Let me get on this. And said, Nehemiah 13 and 25, And I contended with them, and cursed them, and smote certain of them, and plucked off their hair, and made them swear by the Most High, saying, Ye shall not give your daughters unto their sons, nor take your daughters unto your sons, or for yourselves, man. So Nehemiah contended for the faith, man, and cursed them the fuck out, and fought them, and killed them, man, okay? And pulled out some of their hair to defend and debate, all right? Of keeping the laws and dependency of the Yahweh Bashan Al Shah. And we're we're you know, you know, hey, we we hey we come in the spirit of that, man. Okay, we wise as a surf and harmless as a dove, but we come in that spirit, man. Okay? We come in that spirit, man. We're gonna we're gonna contend for the faith. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna blaze you with the with the word, man. Okay. Alright. A contention until we get to the kingdom, man. Alright. Hey, with that, I'm say, Ka halal, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah Bashem, the Kaha Fodash, the to the apostles and the elders, the great millstone, peace, blessings, salutations to the hopefully elect on the four corners, putting this work in faith and truth and sincerity, and to the few sisters that are trying to see the word of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, and numbers, meetings, and silence. Abba, Abba, Shalom.